Hey guys, Gordon LaPlante here from Gcreate. Now, we've just recently printed something we wanted to share because it's really cool. Not too long ago, we backed a Kickstarter campaign called Boneheads 2. Now, Boneheads 2 was the follow-up to Boneheads 1, <laughs> which was also a Kickstarter campaign. Now, what the Boneheads Kickstarter campaigns are, or were, uh, are a series of 3D printable skull models that you can 3D print on your, your own FDM printer at home. Now, these models were made by 3D Kitbash, and you can currently see their stuff on 3dkitbash.com. Now, for the Boneheads 2 campaign, they took their original models, remastered them, added lower jaws, and added a whole new set of models. So, in the end, we found one in particular we loved, and that is a dragon skull. I know, cool, right? So, here it is. The 3D printed dragon skull. Let's see if I can zoom in on this right here. You can see it. That's a great looking, really nice model. Now, okay, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, that's cool, but why not go larger? This is just the test model. So we went ahead and we did go larger. So here is the final model. This is a 400 scale massive dragon skull that we printed to show off just how cool these models really are. How great is that? This is just around, I think it was a 23, 24 inches, something like that, in, from tip to, to the snout here. Um, we printed it 400 scale from the original file. It has two perimeter walls, 10% um, or 12% infill. Uh, it was printed in ColorFab PLA, uh, white obviously, is the, the off-white. Um, it took whew, just over 70 hours to print all three portions. So when it prints, it prints the top of the jaw in two parts, one part here and then the other side. And then it also prints the front of the, the lower portion of the jaw all in one pass. Here. We printed, I think uh, the perimeter speed was, or the, the speed of the print was around 70 millimeters a second, and the perimeter speed was about 65% of that. So it was a little bit slower. But let's see if I can get you some detail here. Yeah. We were very pleased with the outcome of this. We had a lot of fun uh, printing it and uh, really just, <laughs> just holding it is something else. It's really, really cool. So now you're also in luck because while we printed this model, we happen to have our time-lapse cameras finally set up. So we're going to go ahead and show you the time-lapse of the, see the back of the skull and then the lower jaw of the skull, which we thought were both really, really cool. So again, a big thank you to uh, 3D Kit Dash and the Boneheads 2 campaign. Uh, we love your stuff. Uh, it's very high quality. We've been very, very pleased with it. And I think they actually have a live campaign right now. Uh, maybe we'll link to that in the description. But uh, yeah, we had a lot of fun showing this off. This is more of just a, a fun video just to show you what you can do with 3D printing, especially when you go large. So we hope you enjoy the time lapse and keep on printing. This thing is massive. <laughs>